everyone. It's once again uh, Shinty666 here. Um, obviously, Emily and Alice for our lovely Agave Blow vlog. Woo! Okay, finally. Finally, yeah. I know we've made our um, break quite large this time. Um, but yeah, it's just been, we've been away and there's been like job circumstances and stuff. Anyway, so we're back. It's cool, finally. Yay! <laughs> um, this time we're doing our vlog on dieting. Um, I know it's quite like a concerning issue to lots of gals out there, especially in the West, where like um, perhaps like our metabolisms and diet, uh, like everyday food isn't as healthy as like that in the East kind of thing. Anyway, uh, so we both um, are still losing weight, but have lost a lot of weight in the past, and uh, so we've collected like a lot of tips. Um, together and also got some diet pills that we know work for us anyway to show you so um, yeah and with that it's cool so um, yeah <laughs> share, what should we do first um, do the tips first. tips first okay cool so these are our tips obviously um, the main thing is which everyone tells you anyway it should do generally is drink lots of water it's about eight to ten glasses or pints per day um, obviously if you're younger so like 15 and under try to just make it like 250 or 500 ml glasses rather than a pint because otherwise you can end up with hypoglutremia which is water um, intoxication which isn't great so <laughs> okay also uh, walk um, everywhere that you can you know even if you only walk like a small distance then do it yeah that's really important also um, what we've both found out that works is um, even though it kind of may seem like a con in some infomercials is Zumba uh, which is basically like a dance workout. All of the moves are especially designed to crunch stomach muscles and work arms and legs at the same time. And you really do end up in like a right sweat. It's really lovely, but um, it really does work. Um, if you prefer doing a workout or doing both as well, um, we recommend like 30 minutes of each. It's really good. So you get an hour per day. And also like remember to stretch in the morning because otherwise um, none of your muscles and stuff work. Yeah. So that's cool. Uh, yep. Yeah. Um, Drink lots of milk and get lots of calcium in your body because even though it's got, you know, some have got high fat content, it is going to be good for you. Yeah. So maybe um, either skimmed milk has the highest calcium, less fat, or, um, you know, semi skimmed. Semi skimmed is really good as well. So that's like in America, it's 2% fat. So that's really cool. Awesome. Okay, also uh, eat lots of fruit and veg, obviously, it's a given. Um, as well as having uh, just no fat basically in any fruit and veg, um, apart from stuff like bananas, avocados, stuff like that. Um, it's just really, really high in all your nutrients that you generally need for your body and um, it, it's just really filling. You know, you can make everything out of that. Um, obviously try not to use so much oil, etc. when you're cooking. But also when you cook, uh, try not to cook it for too long. Try to leave the vegetables crisp as that will um, like not zap out any of the important nutrients. Also, fruit is good for snacking on as it is well. Very good. Like I snack on kind of like sultanas and raisins throughout the day. So sultanas are nice. <laughs> yeah. um, try to cut out as many carbs as you can. I mean, obviously you can't go without any carbs because that's just you know impossible. But pasta, bread, you know the really heavy stuff because that will just keep the weight on no matter what else you do. It so. definitely will. Yeah, that's yeah, that's a big thing for me, especially like in my household. Mum just always buys tons of bread. Yeah, crap, so, yeah. And all we've got is pasta. Okay. Yeah, exactly, in the cupboard. And I'm like, why? <laughs> so, yeah, try to eat as, as well. Um, rice is really glutinous, which also sticks to fat um, and doesn't make it loose from your body. So, just be careful of that. <laughs> okay, awesome. Uh, also, uh, slowly reduce your portion size. Um, as if you do it completely, like if you make your portions like, you know, 300 grams as like on some anorexic diets suggest, and or like 150 grams per meal, that's ridiculous. If you do that, um, you will end up hungry and end up going back to eating more or binging, which yeah. is really bad. So try and, uh, not to do it too quickly, but yeah, to do so. Um, make sure you take lots of multivitamins as well, like kind of like before you go to bed yeah. or in the morning, just yeah. to kind of, you know, make sure you're getting everything definitely before you go to bed is good because um, you're not doing anything obviously other than sleeping yeah. and so like your body can absorb it it's really good also um, check food packets if you're eating like out uh, say like even if you're eating fast food um, or whatever uh, just check the grams of fat rather than the calories calories are energy which you need because you're not eating um, carbs as much as possible 
so um, just look for the grams of fat. Try and eat three grams of fat or under if you can for every single meal. And uh, obviously just ignore the fat because you want to use up your body's supply of it. Okay. And our last tip, which is probably going to be everyone's favourite tip, is <laughs> have at least one day off where you can just treat yourself yeah. to whatever you want. One day a week when you're dieting really hard and as long as you keep working out, even if you work out on that treat day, um, will not affect you whatsoever. Um, it's only if you continuously eat rubbish um, or loads of carbs every day that you'll gain weight. So, um, yeah, just like, I mean... I didn't eat any anything rubbish for like three weeks, not even caffeine or anything. And um, then I ate like three days worth of like, not not on one day, it was like three three days like pizza and stuff. And um, I still didn't notice anything happening because um, it all tends to muscle and everything. And your body uses a lot of stuff. It's fine. It's really good. It's cool. Okay, those are our tips. That's cool. Now we get on to the diet pills that we recommend. Yeah. Okay. Um, so Alice. This is one that I got from my tanning salon. It's called Simply Trim. I've only been using it for kind of like three days now. But I have noticed a difference in um, why it's helping me. It does suppress sort of hunger. And I, you know, I kind of bored of me as well. That's one of my problems. <laughs> <laughs> bored of me, yeah, same yeah. time. Yes, it's bad. So it definitely helps with that. It has a lot of caffeine in them. So you're always buzzing. And I did find like the first day that I took one book actually was that I was, my hands were shaking and stuff. It was quite funny. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'll have to let everyone know if it does work or not. How exactly. Can okay. compare sizes. And yeah. Stuff. yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, actually, that reminds me. Didn't add it into the tips list. Uh, really, only eat when you're physically hungry. When yeah. your stomach, when you're like doubling over in pain. I know it sounds absolutely ridiculous um, to some people, but it really, really does help. It's not when you're like, oh, actually, yeah, I fancy that. That's yeah. that's really bad. Like, um, it's your brain telling you that you're hungry when you're not. You know, just listen to your body rather than what you kind of think like. Okay, like when you can actually hear yourself being hungry. Yeah. Then do it. Um, okay, I take Adios. It's heavily advertised everywhere. Um, this is the max version because it really does work. It's only like a pound more expensive than the normal one. Um, contains 100 tablets. Um, I find it really does work. This is the third time I've taken it now. And it's working a tiny bit slower because I don't have that much water weight anymore. It's just the essence of toning. But um, definitely the first time you take it, uh, take one at meal times just before. If you take it after you eat, I find that I really, really need to throw up. It's horrible. And I'm not bulimic under any circumstances, so it's really nasty. It's kind of like puffs out and um, it's got lots of um, laxatives in as well. So it just like kind of makes everything flush out your body. But it does work. So it's about um, 10 quid roughly. That's awesome. Okay, so that's what we've got to talk about. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be back soon. Hopefully, slimmer and trimmer. Slimmer and trimmer, exactly. There we go. But <laughs> healthy. <laughs> but healthy, exactly. No, like starving yourself, and then as soon as you eat like a crumb of cake, then you like gain three stones. <laughs> anyway, so let's go. <laughs> All right, thank you. See you later. Bye. Bye.